Hey guys, the objectives of this video are to discuss distributed loads and to resolve distributed loads into equivalent forces. So we start with the question of what is a distributed load? So up to this point in this course, we've just been talking about point loads. So we've had situations where we've had like beams and then we've had forces along that beam. So we've had forces there and there, and these all act at through um, one point only. Now, the difference between this and distributed loads is that distributed loads are forces that act across an entire length. So they're forces that are uniform across an entire length. A good analogy for this is just imagine standing in the middle of a beam. Um, when you're in this, um, when you're in this upright position, you'll be uh, exerting a force through one point effectively. So you're, because it, all of your weight acts through your feet, it goes through one point. So basically we can think of this as being a point load. If you were then to lie down on this beam, you're now sort of spreading out um, all of the force that acts through you across the whole length of the beam. And we would consider this to be roughly a UDL. So this is a uniformly distributed load like these cases here. Okay, now we'll just have a go at um, looking at an example. So we've been asked to find moment at A. A is this point here. We have a beam that is L meters long and we have a UDL, which is given to us in the units of